Is it centered? There you go. Is it good? That's okay. better. This is probably one of the best activities that I have ever seen in my teaching career. It is an activity for teaching your child how to uh, write their name. And simply, all you're going to do is you're going to take your child's name. Uh, you probably want to look up the Zaner Lozer, and we'll write that in the comments. Letters, so that you're forming the letters correctly for them. You're going to write their name, then you're going to skip a letter, skip two letters, skip three letters, and so on until you get down to just nothing. And don't expect your child to be able to do the full activity uh, at the very beginning. Uh, you're going to need to probably work with them just to be able initially to trace their name. Uh, this activity, by the way, is uh, an activity that I completely stole from uh, Mrs. Polina at Panther Valley Elementary School. And what she did with this paper is she ran it through a laminator. I came up with a more cost-effective way so that you don't have to pay for lamination. Unfortunately, with the camera, we're probably going to have an awful lot of glare. And that is very simply slip your paper into a gallon zip type baggie and you're going to use a dry erase marker these are like a dollar fifty at walmart or anywhere that actually sells uh, office supplies grocery stores have them and basically you're going to have your child just trace over their name every day And the first day, the first few days that they do it, it's going to be difficult. And then when they get to that second row, they're going to trace everything. They'll have all the answers of how to write their name except for the last letter. And you just can help them the first few times learning how to form that letter. Probably don't want to go as high as I just did. And then each time they do it, they're going to have to write the next letter until they're writing their full name at the end. And they might not be able to do this in the beginning. You're going to have to help them with it. But till the end, they will have it down to a science. It amazed me that most children in Miss Polina's class, Mrs. Polina actually, um, were able to write their name probably by by the holiday break in December, by Christmas break. And I was very impressed because I've seen children really struggle over the years with writing their name. At the end, you can take um, anything from a paper towel. If you want a more sustainable way to do this, you can use an old sock or a new sock if you don't want to use an old sock. And you just wipe it away. It's ready for the next day. And you save how many pieces of paper and you teach your child how to write his or her name.